um, if there was, so you've now, we've all been through various things and we shared some of it, some of our journey um, that we have experienced in, in life. Um, what, if you had the opportunity to go back in time as your current self, is there anything that you would share with yourself, like yourself? So let's say we'll go back 10, 15 years ago. If you had just like five minutes to talk to your 10, 15 year ago self, like 10, 15 years ago, you had the moment to talk to them. Is there anything that you would say to them that wouldn't necessarily maybe alter their, the journey or it might um, in your life? Well, what would your words of wisdom be, if anything, if you had that opportunity? I'll say really quickly, uh, trust the process. Trust the process. Don't try to fight it. Don't try to control it. Because that's always, always, that's been my biggest lesson that I need to continue, that I need to learn is not trying to control. As I mentioned earlier, just let, let life flow. It will all come together. Uh, if I had to talk to me 10, 10 15 years ago, Man, y'all know I'm a different person. So I would probably tell myself to man the hell up. Like, that would be the conversation that I would have with me back then. Man yo ass up. Um, and when I mean that, I mean uh, stop being scared to take ch chances. Stop being scared to uh, be who you are. Uh, take those opportunities as they come. Um, appreciate the people in your life. Um, but man the hell up. You know, I think 10... 10, 15 years ago, I was still scared to be intelligent and I was still scared to be um, successful. I think achievement frightens me, like, or it did, it frightens me. It, it, it's one, I, we, we've shared this before that I kind of have a fear of rejection, but I also have a fear of failure. You know, things that I feel like I'm gonna fail at, I don't pursue, you know, and I only pursue those things that I know I'm gonna be successful at. Um, but when we talked about earlier about getting uncomfortable, that is uh, definitely something that I would need to tell my younger self. Like, do not be scared to get uncomfortable. It is okay. You're going to be fine. Listen to the people who are in your ear telling you the right things. Um, and man your ass up. <laughs> so I would tell myself, um, one of my favorite quotes is, can you tell me who you were before the world told you who you should be? And when I think about who I am right now compared to who I was 15 years ago, I was becoming who the world told me who I should have been. And I'm now becoming who I want the world to know me as. So I would tell myself that quote to start saying, stop conforming, do not conform to the ways of the world. Do not adjust yourself to make anybody else happy. Do not hold yourself back because as Brandon said, you're afraid of failing, but then at the same time, you have a purpose and you cannot, you're, you cannot, um, somebody's waiting for you to show up so they can't walk into their purpose until you do something. If you continue to operate in fear or you continue to shape shift to appease other people, then you're delaying somebody else walking into their purpose and you have a calling that you need to fulfill. So, I would recite that quote. Can you tell me who you were before the world told you who you should be? Awesome. Awesome. And for me, I would tell myself um, that you are beautiful. You are valuable. And just believe that. Um, believe in who you are. You know, don't let others define you. Um, I would just really try to pour into her just for her to see her value in an amazing way um and once again not to allow others to to as similar to what z said like not to allow others to put a value on you um because you're valuable anyhow so i would definitely tell tell her that 